I saw a little funny little video on TikTok about a question about being stuck in a forest with a bear or a woman. Not, sorry, not a woman, a man or a bear. That's the whole big thing. Would you rather be stuck in a forest with a man or a bear? And I also saw this video and I thought it was pretty funny. Watch this. It's like a dog, but it comes up to you and you feel it. It is full of fleas. No, no, it's, it's not. It, it gets fetted by the, the, there's a vet on the on the thing. Look, look, see. <laughs> <laughs> so this guy's talking about how foxes are friendly and stuff, and then he gets bit by a fox almost immediately after. Look, see. <laughs> And I find that very hilarious. I saw that video this morning and I was like, wow, that's actually really awesome. I love that that happened. Mother Nature just showed us all a perfect example of what Mother Nature is. And this time it's in, uh, are you all right, Petey? Did you just shit somewhere or something? Why are you panting? Anyways, yeah, Mother Nature strikes again. And then fucking Gumby started cackling towards the end of the video. I don't know what happened. <laughs> I mean, who is that? <laughs> who the f laughs like that, bro? British people. That's who. British people. Tomorrow, 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 not tomorrow. But it led me into a bigger question. I saw this and I was like, hey, this reminds me of that man versus bear thing. I don't know why it reminds me of it, uh, but I'm going to give you guys my thoughts on this because I think it's really interesting. It all started, it seems like, with this video that went viral on TikTok from a show called Screenshot HQ or something. And it is as follows. Would you rather be stuck in a forest? With a man or bear? Bear. Man is scary. Bear. Um, with a bear. Well, I've heard about bears. They don't always attack you, right? Unless you, like, fuck with them. So maybe a bear. <laughs> Pro depends what man, but probably a bear. 100% oh, a bear, which is, like, terrifying to say, but... Definitely a bear. Some men are very scary out there. A bear. <laughs> I would say, I would say a man. One person, one lady said man. See, I would say a man. I would say a man. I would say a man. And everybody wants to hang out with bears. I saw this and I'm I've uh, I'm not exactly a normal guy. My brain doesn't exactly function in the way that it is intended to normally. <laughs> Okay, I was homeschooled. I didn't have any friends. Uh, I have a YouTube channel now and I live in a, a house on a lot of land and I don't socialize. I don't leave that house and stuff. Very unusual guy. So I'm, I'm literally the vacuum. I am the non-existence, the darkness of space. When I see stuff like that, you get a purely unique perspective from me <laughs> because I am not a man. I am a god, you dull creature. No, no, I, I can see it, right? Like, I understand exactly what's going on here. Men are dangerous. That's that's like the sort of general consensus, it seems like, amongst these this pool of eight women ass on the street in Great Britain. I would rather be in the woods with a man, because I'm a man, to be honest, and I feel like mano y mano, I could, I could f up a guy if he started acting, if he started getting prissy with me. But I know that if a bear was in the woods, I would die. Like, even a small black bear, I would try to fist fight it, but I would probably die. That's just, you know, a pure hypothetical s scenario. I've been around bears, I've bow hunted, and there have been bears there. That's very scary. Depends on the bear, though. But, uh, statistically, I feel like it's probably safer to be in the bear in the woods with a, a bear, right? Because it's just gonna run away. I mean, like, Let's see. What percent? This is no bullshit either. Like, this is not, I'm not getting political. This is no bullshit of bears attack people. Since 1784, there have been 66 fatal human bear conflicts. <laughs> so guys, I, I think statistically, there's probably been more men who have hurt, harmed women than um than uh bears since 1784 statistically off the top of my head i get what it's saying is like men are dangerous and stuff which i would not like to believe that but i'm just gonna go to statistics so the odds of being attacked by a bear are one in 2.1 million according to petpedia and that's all bear species according to this very small little bit of information i have here so that's not vetted that's not researched that's not verified signed off on in any way that's purely just this little tiny thing i feel like you're better off if it's just like a purely hypothetical world okay am i safer in the woods with a guy or a bear statistically let's see how many men have 
killed women since 1784. Okay, but we got to do like per capita though, right? Because there's, it's got to be per capita because there's only so many bears. Let's see. How many bears are in the world? I don't know how to do the per capita math. I'm going to guess it's less though. See, there's a million, right? Let's just round it up. Let's say there's a million bears and there's 8 million people. And let's see. I mean, how do you do the how do you do the ratio of that? I don't know. There's also less bear encounters though. It's like people encounter men, p other people a lot more. So maybe maybe it maybe it's just, I don't know. Now that I'm thinking of it, if we're just looking off what I can find off Google, I'd rather be I'd rather be chilling with a bear. Seems like because they just might run away. But if if I have to interact for a minute, let's say, with a man or a bear, I'm going to choose a man every single time, dude. I'm going to choose a guy and I'm going to hope it's like someone cool like Pee Wee Herman or someone like that. I don't know, dude. Kendrick Lamar, all right? Someone cool. That's who I'm gonna, or Willy Wonka. Something interesting. It's the end of, what is this? By the way, go to sour.gg and buy uh, sour candy. We got sour candy in stock. Go to sour.gg, pretty pretty cool over there. I mean, I make, I have a candy company that I, anyways, I'm kind of like Willy, Willy Wonka. Uh, I don't really want to look this up. How many assaults are there yearly? Oh my god. Fuck. Okay, and I wonder what percentage of that is perpetrated by men. What percent of assault is perpetrated by men? An estimated 91% of victims. Oh my god. 99%. Is that accurate? I guess reported, right? Like actual reported. Oh my lord. Across the board, in my opinion, statistics, no matter what it is, no matter what ugly truth it uncovers, it's important to understand context, but just in general, if we're talking about bears and dudes hanging out in the woods and I'm a girl, I'm going to probably say it's just like I'm magically placed in and I can go. Ah! Ah! <laughs> a bear is probably going to run away. If I do that to a guy, he's probably going to be like, <laughs> and then there's like a one in 20 chance that he's not a good guy, maybe. How many offenders are in America that are male? 93.6 of abuse offenders were men. Okay. 750,000, so 80 to 90% of that 750,000 are, are, are just like, yeah, there's just a much higher chance you're just gonna find, you're just gonna be like, I mean, I get it, right? I understand it. I get it. That's that's sort of the point is I definitely understand it. In reality, I'd rather hang out with a guy for sure, you know, because it's a guy, but and I could probably become his bro or whatever. But uh that being said, I just don't know, right? I don't I don't have the experience. I don't have the negative experience. And statistically, it looks like bears are safer. Though. I don't know. I've been asked about this a lot too. It's kind of kind of weird. Like people are saying, "Weigh in on the man versus bear thing. Isn't it crazy that women think that men suck?" and stuff it's like i mean yeah sure right but like uh that is that is terrible misandry i feel like it's an actual thing that happens the hatred of men for no logical reason uh but at the same time like bears have better pr or something for some reason why why I, I just don't see it as that simple i just don't see it as that simple why why are you asking me this question for one i'm not a girl i'm not afraid of men i'm not afraid of, i'm more afraid of bears than i am of men easily all day long i've seen them they're very scary i would rather chill with my bro than get dissected in the woods violently by a, a black bear okay it's just one of those things i really don't know i'm fin sitting on this as well i i genuinely have no idea seems like statistically speaking if we're talking about instances of just attacks and just danger bears have killed way less people than people have killed people but at the same time it's like there's a big round statistical contextual nuance thing that <laughs> changes that drastically how many times have bears run into people how often does that happen how big are the bears what gender are the bears because i'd say female bears are more dangerous because they have more to protect they have more to defend all right and maybe in a certain season maybe breeding season male so there's a lot to it right there's context that's what's important guys i feel like that's what's important i feel like anybody who feels like they would rather hang out in the woods with a, a bear than a man is really speaking to all of this whole thing we're all living in, this, this whole, this is crazy. Bro, what are you talking about, man? It's kind of unbelievable. But at the same time, I absolutely get it. Actually, you know what? Let me go ask a woman real quick. Let me go ask a, let me go ask a woman for her opinion because that's probably more important. A woman with actual experience with men. Ah, shut up! All right. Have you ever seen a bear? Yes, I've seen a lot. Have you ever seen a man? Would you, no. would you rather uh, stay in the woods with a man or a bear? A man you didn't know or a bear? What kind of bear? Uh, it doesn't matter. Any kind. Mm, no, it matters. It doesn't matter. It's a hypothetical question. It's can to, it be a black bear? It, it can be whatever type of bear. Bear. You, bear. Bear. 
Just a bear, an average bear. bear. Like, is it a random man? I don't know. Is he bigger than me? Yeah. Like, a lot? Well, how come you didn't ask what type of man? That's what I'm asking right now. Oh, I don't know. Oh. Doesn't matter. There's a lot of backup like. questions I have. But if I had control <laughs> of the situation, yeah. small bear. Oh! With no mama around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that's what I was saying is like, because like, I mean, a sow is way damn more dangerous than a little male bear. Unless it's breeding season. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So it depends on the situation. Mm -hmm. Say say it's a uh, stereotypically scary man. Okay. Or a stereotypically, whatever that is in your head. Okay. Or a stereotypically <laughs> scary bear. That's like. <laughs> I'd say man all day <laughs> with that situation. I know, I'm, I know bears. I'm scared of bears. They're scary. And if do, it's like stereotypically uh, scary, I feel see, like I don't this like just this makes question. sense. I don't like this question because do I have a gun? Yes, you do. Then a man, right? Yeah. Way easier to kill a man. <laughs> have you seen a, but a grizzly bear? Like when you say scary bear, I think. Oh, I can't. I yeah, I mean, I can't even thousand imagine. Thousand pound grizzly brown bear. I think episode six, season seven, Game of Thrones bear. Exactly. I think Revenant. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I think I think it really just depends, and I feel like people are getting really upset over this, and it's pretty. It's That's very dumb. funny. Yeah. <laughs> it's dumb. It's a hypothetical though, Christina. It's to open up larger conversations. Gun. Carry a gun. Live in a state. Shoot, man. Yeah. Don't have to worry. All Exa day. Exactly. Bear, you have to shoot five times, man, once. I started blasting. Bang. Wow. Bang.